Right guys, so the time is 8 a.m. and I'm due to get my tan in about five minutes. So I'm just gonna have a rice cake and I have had that big breakfast that you saw this morning. And then I'm going to have um, 12 ounces of water in between a few of these meals and just keep sipping on water and see how the body responds. But I'm in a really good place. I actually lost weight overnight, which is pretty crazy. So we'll see how we get on. I'm gonna get my tan. I'll see if I can film in there, but I doubt I can. Um, I will catch up with you guys on the way back though, so um, I'll see you soon. So that is the tan done guys, so I'm going to head back home and start to carb up because I'm feeling pretty flat, so I'm going to need some food. So I'll catch you guys back at the house. Show time baby. Rice cake jam. Feeling the rest of the time. Sounds pretty good. I'm definitely the most shredded I've ever been. I'm one of the most shredded in that time room. But I just need to fill out, bro. And considering I didn't even train yesterday, so. My body's like ready. I'm gonna throw in the pump, the pump stuff, the nitric oxide tablets. I've got some citrulline malinate, which I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna consume about eight grams of that before I go on stage with my pre-workout. And all the carbs that are just sitting there ready. Just fold the muscle. Oh. Some bags in case. Let's do this again. Do this shit again so we get it right. It's not sticky though. It's just it's going all the fucking hands <laughs> Right boys. Scooper of the guards, baby. <laughs> get tired of this, can you get it? It's crazy. Mm. Right boys. Special ingredient. This will go with my pump up stuff, so this is gonna go with <clears throat> the cocktail of the gods to get the extra juicy pump pre-stage. So it's just citrulline malinate and it increases nitric oxide and blood flow within those muscles. Right, so I'm gonna go with the recommended dosage is six to eight grams. So you know I'm gonna go with eight grams. I feel like I'm watching Breaking Bad. That's the way we go, baby. You are bodybuilding edition. 
Sick on Lifestyle Edition. Feeling pretty good now. Can't do it. It's crazy, bro, to feel human. Like, I feel like I can walk around. I feel like I have energy to just even pose a little bit. I mean, I, I still feel a bit like a carcass, but it will come as we slowly up food intake and up water. And I've just finished eight ounces with our, that meal, so I'm going to have 12 in between and just sip as I go now. So I feel like I'm that's enough water for now, really, for a little bit. So that's 7.4 of the finest Colombian pre workout. <laughs> joking. So eight grams there, boom, bang on. I might just put a little dash more in because you just, you know, Zeus told me to. Last night, give me a call, he was like, Brad, this is the secret. A little bit more citrulline marinade. <laughs> this towel, fuck. This is the reality of bodybuilding, boys. Tans and uh, juicy pumps. The woman in the thing was like, so did you have your base tan? She was like, oh, it's just like yesterday when you had your base tan. I was like, I've not had a base tan. <laughs> oh. What's happened? I just need, mm, I need to touch up, that's all. Right. Just getting everything prepped, so. I still feel tired, I still feel, uh, I feel like I can take more carbs yet, like a lot more. But obviously I've got, this is what I've got guys anyway, I'm going to show you while we're here. So, we've got the sour skills, please come over and show them. Um, I've had one rice cookie bars, I've got some more just in case. These bad boys, but I'm going to try these first, I think, see how things sit. And then, and obviously we've got the Snickers bars, just to go right before we go on stage. With the pump up stuff, I'm gonna do caramel rice cakes, peanut butter, oops, pink salt, jam, and then a little bit of honey. Uh, we'll take that in just in case we need it. So, everything's lined up there, ready. I'll take that just in case because if this screws up, all it is is about being prepared, bro. So, if you're prepared and you're ready, then you're good to go and you're not gonna make any mistakes. We ain't about making mistakes. So, everything's ready. I'll take my scale. I don't know why I need it, but I'm just going to take it. I don't need it, but I'm going to take it. These might go into. Oh, I need to be eating two of these because a bit more salt as well. So, that's pretty much everything. Pretty much. Feeling pretty good now. Just going to get my pump supplements. Um, so everything's laid out nicely. That's why you should have a touch up on deck. Never mind, not really popping that much at all. I feel like it's talking away. I think that'll do. Let's check this in. Check this in now. That's, that's a good time. But, um, yeah, it's not too bad. I feel this isn't the best line. Yeah, try. I've got a pump or anything too. Yeah, that shot looks good now. Still flat though, still flat. Yeah, that looks good, that looks good. Yeah, lean. Look at how tiny the waist goes when I lean. So I'll lean a bit. Yeah, back to him. Just lean the shorts a bit. That'll be good. I don't know why, I'm not like any other normal person. I can't like stand up and brush my teeth. I've got to lean over. I'm like a, 
Oh no. I can't be trusted. Showtime, baby. Showtime, baby. So we're all packed, I'm ready. I've got my carbs, I've got my goodies on deck. I've not gone too wild because I don't want to spill. I'm gonna leave it till the last minute. Feeling pretty good. Just see how we're looking. I'm about to get an Uber to Birmingham Town Hall. So I'll catch up with you guys. Looking pretty dry, but we're just slowly filling out. So I'm only sipping on water right now just to slowly fill out the muscle. So I'll keep you guys updated with my plans going into the show and what I'm going to do pre stage. So stay tuned. <laughs> Well, he's good, guys. So we're just in the pump up room right now. Just getting fucking shredded with this guy, this sick cunt. What's your uh, Instagram, bro? TLR training. I'll chuck it on the screen so you guys can follow him. And um, yeah, we're about to go on. With Gentlemen, please make sure that your numbers are visible. You are now ready to go. Can we have a quarter turn to your right? Quarter turn facing the rear. A quarter turn to your right. Go, Brad! And a quarter turn facing the audience. Posing with your arms overhead, your hands open. Posing from the side of your left hand behind your head, showing up the hold. Please. Posing from the rear, arms overhead, hands open. Posing from the side, your right hand behind your head, showing abdominals. No please. Gentlemen, facing the front, abdominal pose. And relax, thank you. Gentlemen, please move to the rear of the stage. Gentlemen, please ensure that your numbers are visible. You are still being judged. So we have three numbers in numerical order. 57, 59 and 66. Yes, Brad! Gentlemen, posing with your arms overhead and your hands open. Posing from the side of your left hand behind your head, showing abdominals and obliques. Posing from the rear, arms overhead. What? Posing from the side of your right hand behind your head, showing abdominals and obliques. Turning to face the audience, abdominal pose. Yes, Brad! And relax, thank you. Starting with competitor 66, 
Gentlemen, please lead off to the side. Gentlemen, pose it with your arms overhead, your hands over. Pose it from the side with your left hand behind your head, showing your abdominals and no fleas. Please turn and face the rear, pose it with your arms overhead and over. Posing from the side with your right hand behind your head showing abdominals and no bleeds. Turning to face the audience, abdominals pose. And relax, thank you. Gentlemen, please await further direction.
And we award the competitors their medals. Thank you. Audience members, can we have a round of applause for your men's physique competitors? Stick in there, love it. What fantastic it was. In fourth place, and with an invite to the British Federal, athlete number 62, Thomas. <laughs> Moving on to the trophies now. In third place, also with an invite to the British Federal, athlete number 57, Matt. In second place, athlete number six, six, Brad. Come on, Brad! And you winner, I'm coming back to compete in the overall at the end of the show. Athlete number five, nine, Ryan. Now we have a final pose from the top three competitors. Any pose of your choice. And relax, just the winner. Second and third, please make your way off stage. Thank you. A final pose from your category winner. Go and bite into it. Yes. The real victory, bro. <laughs> He's going back. Oh yeah, we've got second place. Not the result we wanted, but I'm pretty happy with having no coach and jumping in last minute. So I did what I could. Been invited to the British finals. So that's good. I'm going to enjoy this burger. This is the real victory. Eat it. And then. Yeah, we're going to enjoy it. We're going to have a good night tonight, so... Well deserved, beer bro. It's party time, baby. So, we finished up, we smashed it, we did our best. And I loved every second of the process. So now it's time to enjoy life again. Drink beer. Only a little bit. I don't really overindulge, do I, bro? I don't want to go too crazy, to be fair, but... It's going to be nice to just soak it off and soak up the experience because 
it was such a just crazy process. The benefits of all my sacrifices. So I'm just having a beer, chilling, and we're gonna head out for some pizza soon. I had a five guys before, and that was absolutely unreal. And I actually ended up looking slightly better after the five guys, which is weird. And a lot of guys do say this, but we're gonna throw up a clip on the screen of me in the hotel room after the five guys so you can see what that kind of food does when you're in this depleted state. But I wanted to play it safe. It was my first show. I did everything I could in the process to lead up. It was amazing. I learned so much about bodybuilding, about the sport, about myself. And if any of you guys are like on the on the edge of you know competing and you don't know if you want to compete, I urge you to compete because afterwards it's one of the most exhilarating, thrilling experiences you'll go through. And you learn so much about yourself and about discipline and you've accomplished something, you've gone out there and you've done something and you just, it's, just, it's just a sense of achievement after it. Even no matter what place you take, all the lads there did the best and they're all winners because they did their own. They did everything they could and it was an amazing day with a sick group of people. So that's what bodybuilding is about. It's about us all coming together and unifying because everyone in the industry has got the same goals, the same passions, the same, you know, the same mindset and we're all just individuals want to prosper and move forward and it's really refreshing to be around that energy and that vibe so this is something i'll move forward with looking at going on to the british finals that i've been invited to and i'm really excited to start really actually practicing men's physique posing and getting into the sport and actually you know instead of just going into the gym and i, I love bodybuilding it's my passion this takes it to another level of being an athlete and it's something that i really aspire to do and i think it's a great thing and it's it's such a good process and I've, I've loved every, every second of it. So I want to give a big shout out to all you guys messaging me, all the Instagram messages and everything, all the support has like pushed me through this whole situation. It's been such a sick prep, but such a hard prep. Uh, some of you know, but I won't get into it too much, but it's been unreal because you have to face those trials and tribulations in life. It's all part of um, life itself and being a human being. So I'll leave you guys with that. We're going to enjoy this Corona. Different kind of Corona, a better kind, and then we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna have pizza. And we're just gonna enjoy life, man. And we get this crazy, crazy pumps tomorrow in the gym. We're gonna try out um, some some gyms in Birmingham, so we'll get some good footage. Anyway, guys, hope you have a great week, and we'll catch you later in the vlog. Peace.